Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Our topic is alkylating agents. Alkylating agents are a family of anti-cancer drugs that interfere with cells DNA and inhibit cancer cell growth. They are so named because of their ability to add alkyl groups to negatively charged groups on biological molecules such as DNA and protein. They are among the first group of chemicals determined to be useful in cancer chemotherapy. They remain to be the most important components of the modern chemotherapeutic protocols individually or in combination with other drugs because of their proved and significant clinical anti-cancer activities, alkylating also called cytotoxic agents. Discovery of alkylating agent as anti-cancer drugs has its origin in the use of sulfur mustard gas for warfare during World War I. The sulfur mustard gas was not only fatal, but it also showed myelosuppression and immunosuppression in its victims and animal models. Mechanism of action, alkylating agent directly damage DNA to prevent cancer cells from undergoing cell division. They have a chemical structure that contain bifunctional nitrogen mustard moiety which include two reactive alkyl groups. Hence, the term alkylation, alkylation is used. These groups can cyclize in an aqueous environment to form a highly electrophilic ammonium ion that can covalently bind to any, uh, any nucleophilic compound including the N7 nitrogen position on guanine which therapeutically is a major site of action. They can produce a cross-linking of DNA when both alkyl group react with pairs of guanine residues in DNA. Cross-linking of DNA ultimately results in breaks of the DNA sequence and cell death. Although alkylating agents are not cell cycle specific, rapidly dividing cells are most susceptible to their effects. How a uh, drug work inside body? In this picture, alkylating agent act directly on DNA, causing cross-linking of DNA strands, abnormal base pairing or DNA strand, strand breaks, uh, thus preventing the cell from dividing. Now the classification of the alkylating agent. Um, alkylating agent uh, are divided into six major classes with specific drugs including first alkyl sulfonates drug name is biosulfane second is the ethylamine and methylamine derivatives uh, drug is uh, thiotipa and the third one is nitrogen mustard drug name is cyclophosphamide fourth one nitrouriase including carmastain and lomastain and fifth one is platinum containing agent drug name is carboplatin and cisplatin sixth one is triazine drug name is decarbazine and procarbazine now the first is the alkyl sulfonate drug name is biosulfane is an injectable alkylating agent mainly used in the treatment of chronic myeloid leukemia cml this is a strong drug that causes myelosuppression, which is a side effect that lowers platelets and blood cell counts. As a result of myelosuppression, care team will need to monitor your uh, blood counts carefully for related, related complications such as anemia and low platelets, which is thrombocytopenia. Second, ethylenamine and methylenamine derivatives. Altretamine and thiotipa, these are the drugs used as injection. These types of alkylating agent are uh, used in the treatment of breast cancer and ovarian cancer. Thiotipa, one brand name drug in this type may also be used to treat bladder cancer. Myelosuppression or decreased bone marrow activity is the possible with these injections. Other side effects may include reproductive effects such as the absence of menstruation, gastrointestinal upset and uh, some other uh, side effects. 
थर्ड नाइट्रोजन मस्टर्ड ड्रग नेम इज साइक्लोफॉस्फमाइड नाइट्रोजन मस्टर्ड आर प्राइमरी यूज इन द ट्रीटमेंट ऑफ लिम्फोमा दिस इंक्लूड हॉजकिस डिजीज सेवरल ड्रग्स आर कंसिडर्ड नाइट्रोजन मस्टर्ड इंक्लूडिंग क्लोरम्बियोसेल साइक्लोफॉस्फमाइड आइसोफॉस्फमाइड मेक्लोर एथमीन मेलफेलिन सर्टन टाइप्स आर चाइज साइक्लोफॉस्फमाइड मे बी टेकन ओरली वायर टैबलेट फॉर्म नाइट्रोजन मस्टर्ड मे बी यूज टू हेल्प प्रिवेंट कैंसर सेल्स फ्रॉम रेप्लीकेटिंग ड्यूरिंग एनी स्टेज ऑफ द सेल साइकिल along with myelosuppression other risk associated with nitrogen mustard include an increased risk of infection as well as bone marrow diseases fourth nitrouriaz drug name carmestine and lomustine these are two types of nitrouriaz carmestine injections and lomustine oral tablets oncologist may prescribe these to help treat brain tumors potential side effects to consider include myelosuppression liver damage and pulmonary toxicity which if affect the lungs platinum containing anti neoplastic agent uh, drugs are uh, carboplatin cisplatin oxaliplatin also called platinum coordinating complexes these drugs were differently from other alkylating agent by destroying the dna in cancer cells without the use of alkyl group while these agent are primarily used to treat ovarian cancer oxaliplatin injections are used in stage 3 colon cancer the other two agents in this category carboplatin and cisplatin are also delivered via injection your doctor will uh, talk with you about the potential risk of these agent such as neurotoxicity gastrointestinal upset and myelosuppression anaphylaxis which is a severe allergic reaction is also possible with oxaliplatin Six one is triazine. Drugs are decarbazine, procarbazine, and temozolomide. Triazines are used to treat a variety of cancers, including brain tumors, melanoma, and Hodgkin disease. While decarbazine and procarbazine are used in injection or intravenous solutions. Temozolomide is a capsule taken by mouth. Risk associated with triazine include liver and bone marrow damage, myelosuppression and severe gastrointestinal upset such as vomiting. Now the uses of alkylating agent. These agent are used in treating various forms of cancer, but they tend to work best in slow growing cancer such as brain tumor, breast cancer, leukemia lung cancer lymphoma including hodgkin disease multiple myeloma ovarian cancer and sarcoma now the limitations and side effects alkylating agent help destroy dna in cancer cells unfortunately the same processes that prevent cancer cells from multiplying also affect healthy cells in the body this lead to some of the um side effects chemotherapy drugs are known for uh, the most common side effects uh, these are uh, hair loss known as alopecia anemia uh, reduced blood cell counts pancytopenia missed period reduced sperm count damage to their mucosal lining in the intestine which may cause nausea vomiting and other forms of gastrointestinal upset with alkylating alkylating agent there are uh, also uh, an increased risk of bone marrow damage particularly at high doses this could lead to leukemia in some people contraindications patient with severely depressed bone marrow function uh, pharmacokinetics uh, these drug can be given orally most alkylating agent are given intravenously and it is well absorbed it must be bioactivated by cytochrome p450 uh, to be effective uh, aldehyde oxidase which converts active metabolites to inactive metabolites can become induced in cancer cells producing a unique form of drug resistance if you like our presentation please like share and subscribe our channel thank you for watching our video